Welcome back to Harvest Moon A Wonderful Life. I am on the next day like from the last episode we did and apparently something's happening. I don't know. I think it might be my cough aging up maybe. Hey Mozzie, got a second? I sure do my friend. Let's see what happens. Yes, yeah, my cough aging up. Wow, the baby has grown so big. You won't need the calf hutch anymore so we'll put it back in the tool shed. That sounds good. And take the calf to the barn. We'll clean this for you. I'll clean that up. Okay, awesome. How helpful the harvest sprites can be, right? <laughs> but yeah, the, the little baby is is not a baby anymore anyways. Definitely aged up now, so that's cool. So we're going to ring the bell and get the little baby calf outside, wherever he is. So this is the baby. He's actually like grown a bit. He's still a baby, like he's still young, but yeah, he's um definitely a lot bigger now. Uh, can't milk him or do anything with him or anything, but yeah, it's cool. It's cool that he's older now. Patch is pregnant. Yay, Patch. I'm happy for you, little Patch awesome stuff <laughs> very cool indeed all right then so I guess we are going to milk our cow I guess it's not really worth having more than one cow like if you think about it because you can only really have like one cow that actually is giving you milk you know because like because because the cows just like you know run out of milk so quickly like honestly you're only really gonna have one cow giving you milk so maybe it's not worth it actually to like actually have so many different cows I guess I just wanted to make my my farm look more like a farm like having so many different animals on the farm I guess which is kind of nice to see but honestly uh, you don't really need it I guess but it's fine it's fine all right how many milks did I get let's have a look I got four just a quality milks oh look at our plants they are growing nice and strong it's great to see actually so that's really nice okay time to water them up just like we always do and yeah I'm just gonna I think I'm just gonna do my daily things actually today we're gonna see if we can trigger some cutscenes with Daryl that'd be cool because I don't know if they're gonna start triggering again now I have no idea so I'm gonna check for those hopefully so like I think it's at about one o'clock we'll go into his laboratory and see if anything actually happens it might need to be raining it might it might happen today but it might not so <laughs> we'll have to see it might be dependent on the weather I have no idea so we'll just have to see what happens and uh, maybe I'll check for the 5 p.m. cutscene with Daryl as well because sometimes there's um cutscenes at 5 p.m. with him as well so we'll see if we can get some of those but yeah there should be there should be quite a lot of cutscenes scenes still for us to find so yeah we just have to hunt them down like that's like the the biggest issue really is hunting them down and actually finding them <laughs> it's a chore and it's painful sometimes so yeah we just have to try a little harder all right let's get this little mugwort lovely jubbly that is awesome okay our family should be awake right now as well so that's good i'm going to show my son lots of animal things let's show my son the dog i don't think i've shown oh you can't take the dog in he like jumped out my hand <laughs> Wow, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I can't do anything with my son because he's uh, drawing. Oh, <laughs> sad times. Okay then, I guess. What's on TV today? Hey, wife, you're in the way of the TV. <laughs> Greg fishing diary local information okay this is the second one. Oh, there is a fish called the Colombo although many catch them they should never be eaten raw not only do they taste awful but they will induce vomiting oh damn let's not eat those <laughs> shall I gift my wife a Colombo fish see what she says where are you going wife I'm so happy. Okay, good. I'm glad you're happy, lady. I was just thinking how I now have a family. You do indeed. Cowie me. Ah, dad. <laughs> cowie me, cowie me. Okay, okay. You're so demanding, child. <laughs> I'll give you lots of hugs, lots of affection and stuff. Okay, time to show you some animal products. Where are you going, boy? Smells like milk. Does indeed. All right, where are you going? All right, I'm going to stalk you, child. You cannot escape from me. <laughs> I still have things to show you and teach you, child. Okay, let's show him this. Okay, nice. 
Alrighty, and we're gonna show him this egg. There you go. He likes eggs. <laughs> Yay, so cute. And what else have I got here? Let's have a look. Show him the milk. Did I already show you the milk? I think I might have, but it's fine. All right, what else we got? The clippers. Let's show him the clippers. There you go. Skizzers. All right, I hope this is helping to increase his interest in farm life. All right, he doesn't know what that is. He says my legs are wong. <laughs> Whatever that means. Oh gosh, I just picked you up. Why do you want me to pick you up again? Ah, you are such a demanding child. Oh my gosh. Okay, whatever. I'm not picking you up again. You're just gonna have to stand there with your arms up with puppy dog eyes because I am not doing it, son. <laughs> gosh, I need to stop spoiling my child so much. He's gonna turn into a spoiled brat otherwise. That would be bad, right? Okay, I think we got everything, so that's good. Let's go into the town. What did that say? Ducks, what? Ducks can swim here. Yeah, but I haven't had any ducks. I don't know why. I have no idea why. Maybe I have got too many chickens or something. I'm not quite sure why we haven't had any yet, to be fair. Maybe I'll sell some of my chickens and see if like that triggers anything, because if you have a full chicken coop like you need two spaces then a um ducks won't come so yeah maybe that's why i've got no idea it's gonna collect all these flowers since we're already up here but it looks like carter's already gone into the dig site today so that's good i'm thinking of going into the dig site today as well actually but i want to wait a little bit because i want to see if i can trigger something with daryl so we have to wait till at least i think one o'clock so i have to waste a little bit of time until then <laughs> but that's okay and I guess in a way I guess it's a good thing in a way as well because I get a bit bored going to the dig site sometimes because it's just like the same thing sort of sort of thing so I get a bit bored doing that all the time I guess because <laughs> yeah well it's fine let's go down and I guess we're gonna look around for flowers but if not that's okay I guess we can go up to Sebastian I see Cassie Cassie down there but you can't really gift him anything whilst he's in there sadly okay Samantha's gone into the inner inn which I was wasn't expecting. There's a cutscene! Ooh, is Van here today? I didn't know that Van was here today. I wasn't expecting this cutscene. <laughs> Who'd have thought that effort could do this? Ha 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 ha. I don't feel so well. Is this about the diets again? Didn't we already do this cutscene? Oh, Moti, you came at just the right time. I did. What's going on? I was just about to tell him how the Matkins diet Romano told me to try it turned out. I thought I did this cutscene. I swear I did this cutscene. I am so confused. Last time was a failure, but this time was different. Oh, this is a different time? Okay. This time I spun around like a top with my eyes closed in the middle of my room. How did that go for you? I did this twice a day. According to recent reports, this is the best diet out. I did this for 10 days and then weighed myself on my brand new special scale. Okay, boy was I surprised. I think this might be slightly different, but I don't know. I dropped all the way to 150 ilps. I guess all that spinning and falling down helped. <laughs> it only goes to 150. <laughs> Oof, savage. Oh my gosh. This is gonna guilt trip me so bad. Let's do it. <laughs> the vibrating eyebrows are back. <laughs> oh god. Oh my god, it's alive. The eyebrows are alive. <laughs> Maybe you're right. I really thought it was because of the diet. Oh, oh my gosh, that's so depressing. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. Oh, it's so bad. It makes me feel so, so bad for, for picking that option. <laughs> oh, and he sighs on the way out as well. Oh my gosh, Van. He's such a sent sensitive soul, isn't he? Okay, let's reload it and say congratulations my friend thanks a lot i'm going to stick to this diet for a while uh good luck tim should give it a try too and tim's like what are you trying to say <laughs> so hungry if i can do it anyone can <laughs> whoops i almost forgot to tell romana my results okay i'll be seeing you around 
I think it was mostly the same, but I think there might have been a slight dialogue change with that one, uh, but yeah, mostly the same. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's slightly different though. Okay, time to give you a flower, because that's actually why I came in here, but that's alright. There you go. Did you like it? I hope you did. What a lovely time of year. Sure, why not? I just love the spring. I'm really hoping we can get that milk drinking mini game to unlock with Rock this year as well because I totally missed it on the first year and I was really hoping that I would get it but it's fine it's fine we'll try it this year instead okay anyway I don't think there's anything else for us to do in there so we're good I think I wonder do you think we should go and like visit Vesta or something just because we haven't been in there in like ages and like I got a cutscene I wasn't expecting in the inner in so like isn't it possible that we might get some unexpected cutscenes at Vesta's maybe I don't know there might not be but I'm just gonna check anyway it's been a while since we actually came in here oh my god Katie's in here I wasn't expecting her to be in here I was actually wanting to give her a gift anyway so like I guess this is a a good thing I suppose there you go she looks so happy isn't it isn't there anything to do here I'm afraid not you came to the wrong place if you wanted to find things to do <laughs> you're not gonna find much here at all how's it going I'm Vesta's younger brother yes like I've been living here for like two years already like I already know that you're her brother <laughs> but all right then is there anybody upstairs Celia's here we're so packed today there's so many people here welcome Cloud is so cute he'll grow up healthy and happy on the farm that's for sure oh that was a nice dialogue line actually I wasn't very healthy as a child, so looking at Cloud makes me happy. Are you like sort of jealous or something? <laughs> Do you like living here, Mosey? I love it. Okay, good, good. Sometimes Vesta makes us bread. It's always good. Ooh, tasty. I want some bread. Uh, okay, I guess that's all, all you have to say today. We really should like take Cloud out and then just like show all the villagers at some point. Ooh. That'd be good. Welcome, sir. You have to know the right season for each kind of seed. Why are you calling me sir? It's like we barely know each other but I thought that we did know each other but I don't know <laughs> I have no idea anyway nothing going on at Vesta's farm but I guess we got some cute dialogue options with um, Celia I actually quite liked that she spoke about our child like that I don't think very many characters really do speak about your child so like that was cool that was really cool that was satisfying actually I approve I approve <laughs> okay Cody are you ready for some flower goodness I hope you are. There you go, my friend. You look so happy. Yay! <laughs> awesome. Okay, today my head is filled with ideas. Okay, cool. Mm. Nothing really catches my interest. Something feels different. Can't put my finger on it. Did you turn your head? Oh, he's turning his head. Yay! I think we're finally friends. Good, because befriending Cody is a pain in the butt. So I'm really glad that I've actually become his friend now. Might not get a cutscene with him until the until like next year, but you know, we're working towards cutscenes for the future, so. I think that's a good thing. I think that's a very good thing. Uh, whoa, okay. Vaughn is here today as well. Oh my gosh. I mean, we did get a cutscene with him. I just wasn't expecting to see him so soon. So that is surprising, I would say. Okay, anyway, let's go to the villa. Nami is up here today too, which is cool to see. Okay, girl, how are you doing? Don't be so eager just to say hi. Everyone seems happy in the spring. Okay. Let's see if we can go and give Sebastian a gift. I don't know where he would be at this time. Maybe in the kitchen. I mean, like, it's almost lunchtime, so maybe? I don't know. And then we're going to go and visit uh, Daryl. That would be great. And then maybe sell some stuff to Vaughn would be good. That'd be a good idea, actually. Yeah, he's in the kitchen. How wonderful to see you. Yes, uh, carry on with your painting, my friend. Okay, let's see. Do I have anything? I got five of these, so I am sure he will accept these. There you go. You do somewhat have strange tastes, but 
that's okay my friend okay there we go my guy is quite happy today as well which is good to see very good to see oh look sebastian's coming out as well uh i need to find romana at some point and maybe see if i can give her a couple of gifts just to make sure that we are her friend that would be great i think we are but like i don't know i always like second guess myself sometimes when it comes to befriending the characters on this game oh my god it's grant and it's during the day are you feeling okay that milk you gave me tasted pretty, pretty good Okay, he's going into the pub, it seems. How is your farm? It's not bad, it's not bad. Hey, dude, I'm gonna give you some money, so don't worry. Have no fear, have no fear. All right, awesome. He's still not quite ready. Go put some pants on. <laughs> oh, wait, that's all you're wearing. <laughs> okay, let's go and... um. I just really want to see Grant because like this is a rare thing to see him in here. I get so calm here. Good drink and good music. Nice. I feel a little good. Oh, great. That's awesome. All right. Oh, what's up? Sometimes I like to come here to relax and enjoy my favorite drink. It really refreshes my body. Nice. The most affordable stuff is named Moon Trip. Even the name sounds good, do you think? <laughs> um, it kind of sounds a bit like trippy. <laughs> kind of feels like you're going to be taking shrooms or something with that kind of drink. Um, anyway, we should really go to see Daryl before he like like leaves. Because I think he leaves at like 2 or something. So yeah, we should really go and just like check on him. Just to make sure that there's no more cutscenes or anything. I don't know if there will be. So nope, not today. That's okay. Maybe it needs to be raining or something. So yeah, maybe we should check when it's... When it's raining, that'd be good. And Ivan is just about to set up shop, so that was perfect timing. We'll just wait here a second. And then I think I'll sell some goodies to him. That'd be great. Okay, the shop is open for bidness. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Awesome. I'll sell you some of my goodies. I'll sell some of my goodies to you today. Alrighty, let's buy. Do you have Oh, he's selling a fishing pole? Why are you selling a fishing pole? Isn't that the normal one? I already have that one, don't I? I have no idea why you're selling a fishing pole. I feel like I don't need it though. I feel like I already have that, but okay. Uh, gonna sell some milk. I got 12 of these, so we should be able to sell a decent amount. I'm just gonna sell all of them. I don't really need them, at least I don't think so, so we should be alright. Ha, ah, made some money. We had like no money, so it's good to see some money going into my pocket. <laughs> Um, actually, I think I'm going to keep this actually because I'm going to keep it to give like to Sebastian and we'll sell like the more expensive ones. Uh, we'll sell the Moonor so I don't think very many characters like Moonor so we'll get rid of those. That would be great. All right, there we go. I need to start making some dishes and stuff. I really want to do some more cooking so I feel really bad that I haven't been giving anything to my wife. <laughs> I feel like we need to constantly give her stuff. We don't really but I don't know. I guess it's just like I want to be a good husband. <laughs> I suppose. Okay, sell those coins. They're not really worth too much, actually. There's a couple more little bits and pieces to get rid of. I'm gonna sell this as well. I got two of these. Let's get rid of those. 100G is not too bad, actually. Maybe we'll make it to 2K. That'd be great, but I don't know. All right, let's see here what else we got. I could get rid of the goddess drops. I don't really need those, so we'll get rid of those. That would be great there you go i think that was like 300 or something yeah we made it to 2k awesome i don't really know what i'm gonna do with it but still we made it to 2k happiness okay i'm just gonna sell this and then i think that'll be about it i don't think there's anything else i really want to sell so yeah we're gonna we're gonna go with that that would be good have i given katie a flower today i'm not sure if i did or not i've got no idea uh, okay, she's just whinging about her mum again. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do I have anything for you, girl? I think I do. What about this toy flower? Do you want it? Looks so good. Okay, I don't think she she wants anything from us right now. Mari is going into the blue bar, it seems. Okay, um, I'm gonna go and see who is in the firework kind of house today. I'm wondering if they're both in there or if it's just one of them. No, I can never seem to find the 
the other one inside the house. It's like one of them always works on fireworks and the other one is just so lazy. <laughs> he's like never in. He's like never in his house. I always wonder what he's up to. I've got no idea though. No clue what he's doing to be fair. Okay, I guess we'll go to the dig site. I don't really know what else to do today actually. I am not sure and uh, not sure if we're really going to trigger too much today either. I've got no idea. Maybe not. I have no clue. But that's okay. Let's continue to the dig site and maybe we'll get some goodies from there today. That would be awesome. Okay, let's hippity hoppity off. And there is a chihuahua up there too. So cute. I can see his big beady eyes just poking out. How are you feeling? Pretty good, actually. Thank you for asking, Carter. How is everybody feeling today? Since we're on the subject, I hope you guys are having a lovely day today. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to uh, check at... Um at five o'clock as well. Sometimes you can get like really weird cutscenes with Daryl. Uh, sometimes he'll come and like um, talk about your cow and sometimes he'll come to your farm and like uh, spy on your child. So it's, he's, he's a weirdo. <laughs> so maybe we can get some of those funny cutscenes with him. I think they trigger at about five o'clock. So we'll try those ones, but we'll see. I'm just, I'm always trying to trigger things <laughs> and I'll keep trying as long as I'm playing. So <laughs> yes, uh, we have a few things to try for sure. So hopefully we get lucky. Fingers crossed. And I'm going to try for the hybrid crop with Takakura as well. I really want that so bad so we can start like merging stuff together. That would be so cool. I don't know why it's taken so long to, to get that cutscene to pop. I don't know. I'm just going to keep befriending him though. Maybe he's just like not quite high enough. I thought he was though, but I don't know. This game is very mysterious sometimes oh my god I got like three in a row did you see how many I just got that was amazing so many items in like you know in quick succession <laughs> which was great very great I'm not complaining at that definitely not and another one yay I feel like it's a lucky day at the dig site today maybe I had a good horoscope on the tv I have no idea but that could have been a thing I have no clue not any there but that's okay we don't have too much mu much more time at the dig site today. I might be able to just finish off these last squares though. Maybe that would be cool. There's not too many squares left, but we only have 15 seconds. So I guess it's just going to depend. All right, I found something weird. All right, that's okay. Let's keep searching. Maybe we'll find even more weird artifacts or something. Come on, get this last square. Ah, oh, <laughs> well, that's good. I found something, but I wanted to get the last square. That's going to be so annoying. He's going to kick me out just before I get that last square. Like, how annoying is that? <laughs> I wanted that last square. <laughs> no. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> You're affecting my OCD with my squares. <laughs> I got square OCD. <laughs> I don't obviously, but <laughs> it just, it did annoy me a bit. I have to say, it annoyed me a little bit that we didn't get that last one. <laughs> that's a bit annoying, but that's okay. Okay, we're done for today. So that's awesome. I'm going to go see if we can get anything at our house just by going in and out. So we'll have a little look-see. Hopefully we do get something. I wonder what day we're on, actually. I think we're on like the 7th or the 8th. I kind of like lost count. To be honest, the days have been going really quickly, actually, which is great. Uh, yeah, that's really good. I don't really want to sell what I just made to Vaughn. I could, but I'm not really like that desperate for money, to be honest. Oh, yeah. Go in and out of the, uh, the house to see if anything pops up. Might be nothing, but let's just check just to be sure. Just to see. Ah, oh, my child's playing with the ball again. I think we've only got one thing to see with our child. Oh, yeah, it did work. Hmm, now I see. Oh, this is the one where he spies on your child. Of course. So that's what a child would do. I've got some good data now. He's such a weirdo. Hmm, now I see. <laughs> you weirdo stalking my child. <laughs> ah, <laughs> I caught you. I, I'm not doing anything suspicious. I was just a little curious about how children act. <laughs> Go get your own. Go make your own babies. <laughs> God, <laughs> you weirdo. Wow! Oh god, he fell over again. Oh well, 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 well. 
<laughs> oh, he's so strange. I love him. <laughs> he is amazing. Okay, should we try again? Maybe there'll be another one, like a second one. If, am I am I that lucky? I doubt it, but you never know. So what's the last thing? The car. I have not seen him playing with the cars yet. That's the last item I have not seen the child play with. He really likes the ball though, it seems. <gasps> There's another one. Yay. What do we have this time? Oh, it looks like a Muku Muku cutscene. Can this appear just all year round? Is that a thing? I didn't know that. I think this might be the last one, maybe. I think there's four of these cutscenes. Here, right here too. Or maybe this is one we've already seen, because I did do like a little bit of reloading, so this might actually be one we've seen already actually, because I had to reload at one point. Um, so yeah, I think we've seen this one actually. So probably skip past this one actually hey daryl yeah we definitely saw that one so we're just gonna skip past that one <laughs> it's just because i like reloaded it so it's fine but wow i'm surprised i managed to get like two cutscenes like in a row that's kind of kind of cool i'm gonna check one more time then because we just got like two cutscenes for for doing that so let's try one more time and see if anything else pops up i might just be being a little bit greedy here but you never know oh van's closing his shop okay cool uh but yeah i'm just gonna keep checking this like daily Daily and uh, we'll see if we can get anything else to pop up as well that'd be great okay let's try it and see what happens I really want to see my child playing with the toy car as well I really hope we get to spot him doing that at some point my child is gone I think he's in the kitchen probably <laughs> that's where they usually are if you know if he's not there okay that was it there's no more cutscenes for today but we'll check back again tomorrow and see if there's like anything going on tomorrow but yeah we got like at least one cutscene so that was great actually okay let's milk the cow have I milked the goat today I can't remember if I did or not to be fair so we should probably do that <laughs> that would be a, a really good idea okay time to milk you and give me lots of milk so I can make some money that would be fantastic I think it would actually be faster to have the milking room and just like throw him in the milking room so then it all gets done for us maybe it would be faster all right how many did I get there I think I got four right I just got normal milk so I really should buy some better fodder probably all right goat milker let's see i did not milk the goat today so we have to really make sure to remember to do that because this guy does not give you milk for a long period of time so yeah it'd be a really good idea to to make sure we do that for sure all right well let's water all the crops up here we go that'd be great i want to make sure that these grow quickly actually um so yeah i just want to check real quick i just want to see what day we're on we're on the sixth oh damn it's not really like that much time left uh before like we're in summer so that's kind of crazy actually but we'll probably run out of cutscenes by the time that we get to the end of the year like there's actually two years for chapter two so like when we get to the end of chapter two that's really when like stuff Stuff changes and like you know um your child grows up and the villagers grow up and stuff like that so we got two whole years to play on this chapter so yeah we're probably going to get to the point where there's like not too much going on in chapter two but for now we still still seem to have quite a bit to to witness which is which is great so we still got a little bit to do. Oh, you have fur. Nice. Oh, I pressed the wrong button again. I don't know why I keep doing that recently. <laughs> I've done that like twice now for some weird reason, but that's okay. Okay, so let's find the clippers, wherever the clippers are. There they are. Oh, it's been so long since I could chop you. I feel like it's been a really long time since I got any fur from the, the sheep, actually. So yeah, we got some golden wool. That will give us a nice boost in income as well. So that would be fantastic. Actually, I should probably take my horse. I don't actually know where I'm going. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going, but I'm going on an exploration mission, <laughs> it seems. Where's Takakura? We should go see Takakura. Let's see if there's any more cutscenes at night. There is one with Sebastian, I think. So I'm gonna, I could check for that. Yeah, so I'm gonna go and check a couple of houses 
real quick. I'm gonna ch check Kate's and also um, I'm gonna go check in the, the villa as well. That would be really good just to see if anything happens because I'm pretty sure there are some cutscenes there. It just depends. Like we might not get them just yet. I have no idea. Make yourself comfortable. Okay, I just wanna check to see if I've given them flowers today as well, just to make sure. Just happen to love that. Okay, good. I must have already given Samantha one. Uh, hello? Kate is sleeping, do you mind? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, Samantha. I didn't realise that she was sleeping already. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, let's go and see what Sebastian's doing. Although, to be fair, he's probably already in his room. Oh, um, this guy just came out. Oh, if I had just been just a tiny bit faster, I might have caught him in there. That would have been great, but never mind. Oh, it's Lumina. I never really see you here. How nice to see you today. Please make yourself at home. This valley is a nice place, isn't it? What are you doing with your hands? There are so many interesting and unique people. That's true, that's true. I call Grandma Romana Grammy. It's a secret. Okay, did Grandma tell you about me? After my parents passed away, I... I was brought here and grandma took me in. Some backstory. Hey, it's nice to see that she actually talks about it sometimes. Grandma Romana is a real nice person. She's a little strict now and then, but lovable too. I've really come to like it here. Grandma and Sebastian are really nice, but sometimes I get so lonely without my parents and friends. Aww. I wonder what kind of person my father was. I guess you didn't know who her dad was? I don't know. Don't tell Grandma I said I was lonely. It's our secret. I won't tell anyone, I swear it. <laughs> that was kind of cool. We actually got some like different dialogue with Lumina there. So that's actually really, really awesome to see. All right, Sebastian, hello. I think I've already spoken to you today. I'm just like double checking, to be honest. That looks very good. I would know, you know. Okay, that's great. So let's try the human statue. That looks weird. <laughs> what? How dare you? But you don't think the horse is weird? Okay, but you usually accept that as a gift, but now you say it's weird? What What has changed your mind? I wonder. I have no idea. Alright, Romana is probably in here. Let's go have a little look. Hello. Multi, it's nice to see you. Okay, I don't think she's got anything else to say. Uh, to be honest, I just wanted to check on her. Can't give her gifts or anything like that because she sat in her chair. I think we're almost done, actually, for today. I'm going to go and, like, hopefully visit Takakura. It depends on if he, like, decides to go straight to bed because he did yesterday, but he doesn't always. So I guess it's going to depend um, what he decides to do, I suppose. Ooh, I wonder if he's going into the inn. Oh my gosh, the weather is nice, isn't it? Sure is. If, if Grant goes into the inn, it may be possible for us to do the milk drinking contest with Grant because you can actually do it with him too. So, ah, uh, he walked past. No, where's he going? I'm kind of curious where he's going, actually. Is he going to work, like, at this time? That can't be, can it? I have no idea where he's going. Hold on, I just need to make sure that we check Takakura's house. I don't know where he's going, though. He might just be going, like, to the river or something. Or somewhere boring, <laughs> maybe. I don't know. Wow, Takakura's not in here? Where is Takakura today? That's odd. I have no idea. Maybe he's working overtime today or something. I've got no clue. Takakura, where are you at, my bro my friend? I've got no idea where he is today. Oh, he's up there for some weird reason. And Grant just stays here, apparently. Okay, that's interesting. The weather is nice. Okay, you're just gonna stay here then, I guess. All right then, I suppose. Let's give him some milk, just because he's right here, so why not? Here you go, buddy. Is that milk for me? Yeah. He looks so happy. <laughs> I love giving gifts to the villagers. Alrighty. I'm going to go and give some milk to Takakura as well, just to make sure our friendship is top notch. I think it's fine though, but I'm just going to give it to him anyway. There you go, my friend. Do you like it? I hope you do. Are you going home now? That milk you gave me was good. Cows don't give milk. Okay. Yep. I know this already. Walking tutorial. Thank you. I don't want to know anything. I just want to talk to you about stuff. All right. Hello, Dr. Hardy. It's too bad. Okay. Still talking about, about the passing of Nina. 
Okay, I don't know if he's like always going to talk about that or if that will like change eventually. I don't know. I'm going to keep an eye on Grant and see where he goes. He might go into the inn. So like I'm sort of keeping an eye on him for that. So I really want him to go in there like so bad. Turn, just turn. <laughs> I think he just like has a different schedule depending on the day. Where is Muffy going? Oh, okay. She's coming home, I think. Okay. I thought she was going into one of the houses for a second. I was like, what? <laughs> Very strange. Can you imagine she just like goes into someone else's house? <laughs> I would be, my, my character would be very jealous if she decided to do that. <laughs> I'm sure of it. Okay. I get the feeling that when Takakura gets home, he's probably going to go straight to bed, to be honest with you. Wait. Gran is, oh, Gran is going into Wally's? Oh, no, he's not. <laughs> he's not. He's going into his own house. It's kind of, like, weird. Like, sometimes it's hard to tell where the characters are going. Okay, Takakura is going home. I'm going to attempt to go in there as well, but I don't think he's going to let me in, to be honest. But I'm going to attempt it. I'm going to try. Let's see if he lets me in. Probably not. Nope. Okay, that is fine. That is fine. I'm going to call my horse back my horse over here there we go Alrighty. well maybe the milk drinking thing is only a summertime event i'm not really sure but i'll keep an eye out for it because i really want to take part in it so yeah we'll, we'll definitely do that at some point oh i need to order some more bird feed that was my last packet of bird feed so we're gonna definitely order some more of those very very soon i'm probably gonna sell that chick when it ages up so i think it's a boy right pretty sure it is oops i didn't mean to do that <laughs> oopsie that's okay okay let's put this down it is the seventh today oh my it's going so quickly <laughs> it really is okay so time to to go to bed i think the day is over for sure we've done quite a bit so that's good we're gonna check the tv as well see if anything's on oh my god my wife still isn't home <laughs> wow okay tv shopping hour what do we have today introducing the ginso 2000 wow it really looks like it'd make my cooking a lot more fun again oh it's a knife oh yeah the one that can cut through like anything which is a really bad thing to have in the kitchen cuts right through work surfaces not a great tool to have <laughs> it's a scam i tell you it's a scam <laughs> <laughs> okay then well is anything gonna happen today no nope, but okay cool well we're on the seventh now and i think i'm gonna stop the episode here for now but i hope you enjoyed i just want to say a huge thank you to all of my patreons and members for supporting the channel thank you so much i really appreciate that and if you are interested in donating there will be a link in the description box below to my patreon page alternatively you can also click the big join button underneath every video that i create to become a member of the channel thank you so much for watching please comment rate and subscribe and i hope i'll see you next time